Hey, a very good Sunday to you. I'm NBC3 meteorologist Matt Stevens. Hope this weekend is going well for you. Should be in for more sunshine today on our Sunday, but it's still going to be a little on the cool side. We topped out well below average for this time of the year yesterday, only topping out in the 20s yesterday. Today we should make it to the upper 30s near 40, but that's still cool. We're typically in the upper 40s this time of the year. We're into some rain and wet snow showers tonight, and that hangs around for a good chunk of the day on Monday as we currently see it. And we should remain pretty cool through roughly midweek, but a milder push of air does come in as we get into our Thursday. That should actually see temperatures well above average for this time of the year, which is something we haven't really been able to talk about, uh, well, all that much this spring. Here's the Almanac numbers. Officially hit a high of 26 degrees yesterday over at the Syracuse Hancock Airport. 17 degrees was our low. Those were both below average. 49 degrees is typically where we're topping out. And 30 degrees is typically where we're bottoming out this time of the year. Our records are safe at 82 and 2 degrees. Here's our fast cast to get you through today. Mostly sunny skies. Our high temperature up around the upper 30s. Here's our future cast. 8 o'clock this morning. Some residual lake effect cloudiness. Otherwise becoming mostly sunny today. Heading into this evening, mainly clear skies to start, but clouds will be on the increase. Watch what happens after midnight. We're into some rain and wet snow showers. Those will hang around in a scattered fashion through the day Monday. Scattered rain and wet snow showers. Then by Monday evening, we'll start to develop a little bit of a lake response east and southeast of Lake Ontario, but that ends up tapering probably by late tomorrow night into early Tuesday morning as our winds go a little more out of the south late Monday night. Tuesday, going to keep our eyes peeled on a little system scooting by down to our south. Our future cast is one of the models that pulls the snow well south of us. Uh, some of our other short range weather models have a, a tendency to pull that a little farther north. So we'll see how that plays out right now. We're calling it from Syracuse southbound. Best chance of getting into some light snow on our Tuesday afternoon. So hour by hour through this Sunday morning, temperatures starting off in the teens, rising to the upper 20s by late this morning. Hour by hour through the afternoon, temperatures make it up to about the upper 30s, which is above average for this time of the year, or which is below average for this time of the year by about 10 degrees. Heading into this evening, mainly clear skies giving way to increasing cloudiness. Temperatures down to the low 30s by late this evening, bottoming out overnight around the mid 30s and rising back up to the mid to upper 30s with some rain and wet snow developing mainly after midnight. Here's our seven day forecast 39 our high for today. 32 our initial low that may sneak up a few degrees by early Monday morning. Scattered rain and wet snow showers developing mainly after midnight on Monday. Windy 42 degrees that falls back into the 30s. Scattered rain and wet snow showers around under those mostly cloudy skies. 29 for Monday night. Mostly cloudy, scattered lake effect snow showers and flurries east and southeast of Lake Ontario tapering late Monday night. Tuesday a new round of light snow developing from roughly Syracuse southbound. Cool at 38 degrees. Cool at 38 on Wednesday. Early clouds giving way to mostly sunny skies. Here's the rest of the seven day forecast. Breezy at 59 for our Thursday. Early rain and rain showers with a warm front. Then a mix of sun and clouds midday. New chance of rain late day with a cold front. We're mild. Look at that upper 50s. Breezy at 48 for Friday with scattered showers. Turning cooler Saturday. Morning flurries tapering at 39.